Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Yes, my hair is a mess. Today I'm gonna go over my favorite products to revive hair that looks like this. It just, it's only Tuesday. My wash day was on Sunday. Oh yeah, if you don't know me, my name's Rachel Jane and this is where I talk about all things curly. If you are new to this channel, my hair doesn't usually look like this. Well, I mean, it does, but I usually do it before my videos. But today I'm gonna do it on camera with you guys so I can show you how I refresh frizzy hair. You guys, it's officially that time of the month. I mean, year. <laughs> it's officially that time of the year. It is Christmas time. Well, I guess it's Thanksgiving, but to most normal people, it is Christmas time. I am so excited for Christmas time. And guess what? For Christmas time, Y'all can go to my Instagram page and take part in that giveaway that's still going on. Participate in the giveaway. It's gonna come to an end soon. Um, I'm at over 700 followers and once it reaches 1K, I will be giving those prizes away. So make sure to participate. I breath out of breath. So make sure to participate while you can. So let's deal with this. The first thing I'm going to do is add some more moisture to it. My hair is super dry. Obviously, the two products I'm gonna be using for this purpose uh, are the Many Ethnicities Leave-In Conditioning Cream and the Miracle Curls Frizz Taming Cream from Aussie. I never use this on like wet hair for styling. I only use this for refreshing and for this reason. Don't ask me why, I just, I don't know. I don't know. If you haven't gone and tried uh, many ethnicities products, specifically like this or their gel, I don't know what you're doing. It literally smells so good. It smells so good. I'm going to start by wetting my hands. I don't want a lot of water because I, I don't want a lot of water because I'm not trying to get my hair wet. I'm just trying to add a little bit of water so that the moisturizing properties and the leave-in can do their job. I'm gonna take like this much, like it's really thick. I don't wanna use a whole lot. And I'm gonna smooth it over my curls. I'm gonna take a little bit more for the other side and do it again. My roots get really frizzy and dry and this is why I'm going to smooth some onto my roots. If your roots get really oily and are not frizzy and dry, don't do this. Now that that is in, we're gonna basically do the same thing with the Miracle Curls Frizz Taming Cream. So I'm gonna take like that much. On my other hand, I'm gonna just get like that much water. I'm gonna do the same thing, just smoothing it on. So now that I have those two very moisturizing products in my hair, that should help a lot with the dryness. It's really not looking better, I know. Uh, I'm not sure if it's gonna look better, but we will see. The next thing I'm gonna do is use the Many Ethnicities Freedom Curl Detangling and Conditioning Spray. I really sprayed my hair down with that. Once again, I didn't soak it, but I did, I did get a good amount in there. And now I'm just gonna go through and kind of try to redefine some of these problem curls. I'm going to separate my hair now. Yeah, look at that underneath layer. <laughs> I don't like using the spray bottle because the spray bottle seriously like just gets all my hair wet and that just causes more frizz in the areas that I'm not going to brush down. So I like to just wet the brush. I'm gonna, oh God, this needs to be clean. No, no. So I'm going to just wet the brush down. I'm gonna separate this piece with the wet brush. I'm gonna do that with a few of these underneath here because they're really bad, I don't know why. Okay, so now these are done. I'm wetting it in between each strand I do just to keep that level of moisture. It is not gonna help if your brush is too dry. Okay, so the back is looking like this. And as you can see, I didn't wet it all down, um, but there were certain pieces that were really a problem I did have to wet down. So I'm going to let down the rest of my hair and we're gonna work on this top section. Oh Jesus, okay, so we're gonna put this back up because I have a feeling the entire front is gonna meet, 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 meet. The entire, the entire front's gonna need to be redone. So like, look at these here. Uh, I don't know what 
happened. I don't know what happened, but it's pretty tragic. Look at that. Curled right back up. Okay, so I redefined a lot of my curls, and now I'm just going to go over the top layer with this uh, Miracle, <laughs> Miracle Curls mousse. Just like that much. And to finish that off, I'm going to use the Mir <laughs> Many Ethnicities Power Curl Styling Jelly. And I'm just going to take some in my hands, rub it together, and I'm going to go through those curls I just did and kind of uh, put this gel over them. I guess at the same time, I'm kind of finger curling them. In this process, I'm also going over ones that I didn't just do. So ones that are, are kind of dry. I'm just gonna go over them with a layer of this um, Power Curl Styling Jelly. Okay, so I went ahead and put that jelly over all of the curls that I just worked on, and now it's time to diffuse. I'm gonna put it on hot, um, just because I wanna get it done fast. I'm just gonna hover at first. I don't want to ruin the curl at all, so until they are almost all the way dry, I'm going to hover diffuse and then I'll start uh, scrunching with the diffuser. Now that it is mostly dry, my hair looks a lot better. I'm sorry my energy level kind of went down. I just got really tired. It is like 10 p.m. here and I am trying to go to bed. Now that my hair is dry, I'm going to just put it up in my bonnet overnight and tomorrow it should look more defined than it did for today. So if any of you are having as bad of a hair day as I did, hopefully I helped a little bit with some tips and tricks to refresh it a little bit. Thank you so much for watching this video. And if you haven't subscribed and follow me on Instagram and you're watching my videos every week, you should uh, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, guys. And thank you so much for watching. Bye.